Saint Nicholas of Myra was an early Christian bishop of Greek descent from the maritime city of Myra in Asia Minor during the time of the Roman Empire. The Catholic Church commemorates his feast day every 6 December. Nicholas was born in the city of Patara, a port on the Mediterranean Sea, in Asia Minor in the Roman Empire, to a wealthy family of Greek Christians. His parents were Epiphanius and Johanna. Nicholas' uncle was the bishop of the cities of Myra and Lycia. Recognizing his nephew's calling, his uncle ordained him as a priest. After his parents died, Nicholas distributed their wealth to the poor. In his most famous exploit, Nicholas heard of a devout man who had once been wealthy but had lost all of his money due to the plotting and envy of Satan. The man could not afford proper dowries for his three daughters which meant they could not get married, unable to have normal decent work for women, and possibly be forced to become prostitutes. Under the cover of night, Nicholas threw bags of gold through the window opening into the house until the man's third daughter got married. When he was caught during his third attempt, he ordered the man not to tell anyone about the gifts. When Nicholas visited the Holy Land, the ship he was on was nearly destroyed by a terrible storm. But then, he rebuked the waves which caused the storm to subside. For this account, Nicholas was venerated as the patron saint of sailors and travelers. While visiting Palestine, Nicholas lived in a crypt near Bethlehem where the Nativity of Jesus took place. Over the crypt where Nicholas lived now stands the Church of St. Nicholas, in Beit Jala, the Christian town of which Nicholas is the patron saint. Upon Nicholas' return, the Bishop of Myra who had succeeded Nicholas's uncle, had recently died. The priests decided that the first priest to enter the church that morning would be made bishop. Nicholas went to the church to pray and was therefore proclaimed the new bishop. One of the stories of Nicholas is when he saves three innocent famous generals from execution. As they were about to be executed, Nicholas appeared, pushed the executioner's sword to the ground, released them from their chains, and angrily chastised a juror who had accepted a bribe. In 325, Nicholas attended the First Council of Nicaea. He was a staunch opponent of Arianism and a devoted supporter of Trinitarianism. At one point, Nicholas lost his temper and slapped a certain Ariane across the face. Nicholas was imprisoned, but Christ and the Virgin Mary appeared to him in his cell. He tells them he is imprisoned for loving you, and they free him from his chains and restore his vestments. Nicholas died at the age of 73 on the 6th of December 343 in Myra, Diocese of Asia, Roman Empire. In centuries of Greek folklore, Nicholas was seen as the Lord of the Sea. He is also the patron saint of all of Greece and particularly of the Hellenic Navy. For more information about every saints and their feast day, please like and subscribe to our channel, House of Prayers for Everyone.